What you are looking is an application for which I've created a multi-brand approach. This is, I have different look and feels depending on the various application that the brand of this app will have. Each one has its dark and light modes and different density modes, okay? These are sets and subsets created individually starting from the globals, as you can see here. Each one has its own modifications, okay? But how do I manage all of this to make it easier and more comprehensible? That's where themes come in. As you can see here, I have two active themes. You'll notice that I have a bunch of themes created. Um, I have uh, themes for dark and light. In this case, for the light theme, uh, dark is active and pink is also active. You'll see uh, the look and feel change if I activate blue here the look and feel change again and if i activate light each one's interact with uh, its token and variables and alias so how do i create themes themes are a set of sets and subsets that are related to each other and together modify the visual i've created to see this more clearly let's look at the themes list these are the themes I've created dark and light modes, different themes uh, for look and feel, and density settings. If you enter each one, uh, you'll see collections of themes and sub-themes. For example, the active look, look and feel theme purple is composed for the global tokens and the alas uh, created for purple. That along with everything else I can activate in different themes give me these results for instance. So as you can see here in the look and feel section among the, the creative colors I have purples but also have pinks, blues and one set for greens. However I'm not using the greens yet. I'm going to create them as a theme within the theme section where I'm creating the different look and feels I call it green and when I create it you can see that there is no active set yet so let's choose them as we mentioned earlier we need to start from the globals which are the base values and then activate the green tokens now it's active so it's been created if I go back to the theme section we see that the green is there too and if I activate it the tokens are overridden and as you can see I can also switch to dark.